York, which is our first act. Welcome to New York. Thank you. Please look around. So now the big question is what to do with such beautiful and strong words. Here's what I think. Let's taste them. Well, you should get your own way. Begin tonight our dining experience. Uh, the experience tonight is gonna be a 50 course, but we like to call it 50 impression. The rule with this impression is you can't eat it in one bite, you need to eat it at least in two bites. Our take on making a perfect omelette. So uh, it's a membrane of the egg yolk, the natural egg yolk at the outside uh, itself, and then filled up with a foam made of the egg yolks and comte cheese, and brushed with lardo and truffles. It's a bikini sandwich. So instead of using the toast bread, we use uh, inspiration from Japan, the mochi dough. So uh, the sweet rice dough we cry fry, so there's a temperature different from 400 degrees from cold to hot. So you get very crispy outside, chewy and sweet inside, filled with the Goya cheese and Hamandi Bedecro from Rosalito. Our wine pad, which is our wine list. Um, so uh, we have over here the extended wine pairing. We have the uh, beverage bubble, uh, where we have the a la carte uh, list. Uh, so for this part over here, every ring is a category. And then every time you go closer to the center, you get a little bit more specific with your search. Welcome to the third act, welcome to the dome. In here there will be a little bit more structure since we have around 30 impressions that we're gonna go through. We have divided everything into five scenes. Each of the scenes will have a theme. The first one is gonna be the ocean scene. We'll have fish, seafood, so forth. We call this uh, impression French Kiss, two different kinds of reasons why it's inspired by the southern France uh, dish called Fantat. Fantastic, fantastic. So um, it's need to show, case and talk about and raise awareness about plastic in the oceans. So we have a beautiful piece of the cut jar. as possible to keep a, a very meaty texture in the scallop so it doesn't have time to relax too much and get soft so it get very meaty um, and this one is our version of a raw scallop so eat a little bit of the scallop roe together with the scallop soup. For your next impression, you serve your tink out of the box. We will serve you some lamb ring. So 
gestuurd. Er is een ochtend zijn deze binnengekomen. Ons productieteam, wat zij zouden doen is dan... Want we krijgen het hele hoofd van het lam. Dus uh, we halen de hersenen eruit. Daarna leggen we die in een zoutwaterbad voor een periode van twee uur. En daarna pocheren we deze. Nadien worden deze dan ook geglaseerd met een kersenjus. En we serveren deze hersenen ook op een merijk. Die van dezelfde kersensap is gemaakt als de glazing. The foie gras, there's not force fit. So, um, pan fried foie gras in the bottom and layers of Madeira, and then on the top, there's this aerated yeah, layer of the uh, foie gras, so it's a mix of the cold, like the hot and cold. completely in bee wax. The idea was to have a technique where we both could mature the meat but also cook the meat in the same thing. So maturing it for 14 days and then cook it uh, for 51 degrees, so just below the melting point of the bee wax. After the, the cooking of in the bee wax, we take the bee wax shell off and then we grill it, uh, the pigeon on the hospital. made of the essence from shiitake mushrooms and uh, walnut oil. So this one, the essence here is made uh, as well in the special pressure cooker. Collaboration with what's called Hustel. Hustel is on Bornholm, which is one of the Danish islands, and they are known to make seabok thorn. Seabok thorn is a small Danish berry we have that's a lot of acidity. We make our own kombucha with lemon verbena, which is half of it, one fourth sweetened seabokton juice, and a fourth unsweetened seabokton juice. The next impression here was uh, try to see if we could make a fluffy bao. So, inspired by Japan, this uh, wheat bun. Um, the, the whole we thought it would take about two weeks to make this. Uh, we create a uh, wheat one that was fluffy, uh, but it took nearly two, two years to come to this. Uh, we wanted to take the meat out, so we only concentrate about the bun and to see how fluffy we could get it. So we, we serve it with a paste that is made of uh, coriander and aged soy sauce, and we serve it with a sauce here that is made of oxtail. French chicken. It's from the island Baile and the producer Hopomela. It's marinated in teriyaki with burnt hay on top of it. So just give it a handshake. It's very deep in umami. Um, it's from Hoselito, so uh, very thin slices. And then a paste is made of shiitake mushroom or fresh dried truffles. And underneath there is a, a little chill that is made of uh, the pig's trotter. It's an impression called pig fix. Why? Pig fix is essential. It's snide. Snide is a pork snack. And commonly it's not being used in mass production because it's a place where it is syringe. Pigs are being inserted antibiotics. We have our organic supplier from Denmark, Vic, which one is free range. We thought it's a beautiful tool how to communicate of how we treat our animals and we want them to grow fast and yummy. So we created a dish where we comfy the snide in the oven for two days, then seared it, glazed it with spicy teriyaki, finished it with white truffle and in the syringe you can find baked apple sauce. So we fill it up instead with a cold milk ice cream from Copenhagen cold milk. Uh, and then we make a dulce de leche, uh, in the Oku part actually, uh, where we ferment uh, this uh, uh, goat milk for uh, six hours. The next uh, impression is our uh, 
homage to Andy Warhol, uh, the Velvet Underground. So uh, it's our little uh, banana. The banana is uh, skin here is made of uh, a juice of green bananas, milk and sugar, and then we are um, make it in two different colors. So uh, we get the look of exactly the the Andy Warhol banana. So welcome here to the to the balcony. This is the part where people is uh, getting, or the guest is getting coffee and tea and the last impressions. Uh, so this amber here is uh, made an uh, inspiration by Chase White from this ginger gum, completely with a, 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 a wax and the sugar, so it get like a stone. Shape. 